Hi, my name is Sarah Donnelly, and I'm coming from you today through Skype. And I work at Abiding Savior Lutheran School. I teach third grade. And what I want to share with you today is a little bit about Glogster. Um, Glogster is a really neat way for your students to make interactive posters online. And so it's really, um, it's really neat and helpful because students have a background they can choose. They can use tools on Glogster where they can drag and drop information into their poster, and they can make it um, interactive. They can make their pictures animated. They can um, even go onto search engines such as Google or YouTube, and you can find images and pictures and videos, and they can put those into their poster and use those as part of their presentation. So it's also a really neat way to teach internet safety as well. Um, students of all ages love it. My third graders love using it. Um, I know the middle school students here love to use it as well. They were actually our coaches on this project as they knew how to use it already. And they came um, to the computer lab and showed the third graders how to use it. So there's lots of different uses for it. You can um, use it, for example, my students did book reports with it. They, um, instead of making just a poster to explain the book that they read, they found videos. I gave them certain things they had to find. They had to have a video. They had to have um, an image from the internet. They had to have something animated on their poster. And then they presented the poster to the class. And um, basically what they did was just share the information about their book through all of these different images and things that they found through Glogster. Um, it's really neat. When I was talking to some of my students, I, I asked them why they liked Glogster so much. And they said they get to be creative. They don't just have to draw a picture and share and cut and paste things and put it on their poster. They love using videos and they actually just love to go on it and create posters of, you know, you could give them a topic regarding anything for science or social studies or any information. And um, they just love to make posters about it and share what they've learned.